Speaking of which, the mummy. We have uh, Jake Johnson, who I'll just read the trivia now. When Jake Johnson was offered his part in the film, he loved the idea and the opportunity to work with Tom Cruise, who wouldn't, knowing that Cruise mm. does most mm. of his own stunts. He signed on immediately, but when he read the full script and learned what kind of dangerous activities were expected of him, <laughs> actions were expected of him, he admitted to getting cold feet. However, Cruise allowed Johnson access to the private facilities for a rigorous 4.5 month training course, what? making him well prepared for all the stunts he was required to do. So uh, Nick so from New did, Girl. Did, did Jake do all his own stunts as well then? He must have, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't go through a 4.5 month training camp to then not do my own stunts. This is also true. Yeah. <laughs> so the, so Nick from New Girl was basically like Rocky and Cruz was his... Was his... Mickey. Balboa. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So good on <laughs> Jake Johnson. <laughs> and, um, also... Did that Mr. T killed him? <laughs> He didn't kill Mickey. I mean, he like scared him a bit, but he didn't. He like, gave him a heart attack. Yeah. Okay. Could be argued that was many factors, and not just Mr. T killing him. Mist, it was definitely Mr. T. Um, <laughs> but, a but because the cruise has oh, a that's brilliant. Thick, thick booty in the swim. Thick one. booty cruise. <laughs> that's what we should title the pod. <laughs> thick booty cruise episode seventy three. Um, it was terrible. Yeah, it's a bad movie. Really bad. I Russell Crowe. You no, know, I was actually really excited for the Dark Universe. I thought <laughs> said no one ever. <laughs> Yo, I could have mainly because of. Uh, you say this on the first date every time. Yeah, I'll be honest. I was really. No, where were I'm you when the dark universe <laughs> stopped existing? Because I was crying in my basement. <laughs> yeah, unpopular opinion, but Bardem and Depp and Russell really made me excited for this. It's a good cast, but they're. I mean, Russell's waste. Like Russell's just. A, Russell's waste. That's not very nice. <laughs> wasted he's just like he's regular russell and then like he gets a little angry and then his eyes turn white or something i've seen a lot like of in russell, real life and that's not regular russell <laughs> um, i mean the mummy girl is pretty good from kingsman she's, yeah. she's pretty she's solid pre- but the rest of it, it's just so meh like nothing sticks out about it. it's just fine and yeah. the worst part is they actually did make tom cruise scream we have to talk about that <laughs> that too but like the stunts there are actually some crazy, impressive stunts in this, and none of it comes across because of the way it's filmed and edited. Like yeah, it looks the, like the it, plane, could, it could be CGI. The plane, shit, they did that for real. Like they actually flew up in zero gravity and whatever. You don't appreciate it at all. Or like, no. there's also one. I think they like launched a fucking bus at Tom Cruise, and like he like goes in the door. I think we something. all appreciate that. <laughs> and like it just, it looks completely fake because the like, I don't know. With Mission Impossible, you can always tell it's real. You know what I'm saying? Mm-mm-mm. I don't know. But, um, no, yeah, like seeing, seeing that like plane crash scene compared with like the helicopter chase in the in Mission Impossible is like, yeah, it's not even comparable. Jake Johnson's fine, and yeah, I mean, and then at the end, Cruz becomes a sand demon, and he's like, I'm yeah, a, Cruz I'm gets a... like four eyes, but in two eyes, yeah, good on him, good on him, yeah, classic Cruz. I mean, thank you for bringing me back to life and everything, Nick, but what are we even doing here? <laughs> 